There's a crazy theory about Spider-Man No Way Home. Dude, I cannot wait for Spider-Man. So recently, new rock star and King Von switched to the theory about Spider-Man No Way Home. And this theory may confirm who the villain is in the new movie. So the director of all three Spider-Man in the MCU, John Watts, actually uses like license plates and signs to like foreshadow what's going to happen next in the movie. Wait, so the license plates predict what's going to happen next? Okay, so in Spider-Man No Way Home trailer, we see Peter on top of the bridge, right? In the Iron Spider suit. And if you look, there's a license plate that said 1963-03. And it's referring to the Amazing Spider-Man comic comic issue number three that came out in 1963 and that is the first time spider-man fights dr octopus and right after that we see dr octopus come onto the bridge no way and this is what's gonna blow everybody's mind so in spider-man no way home trailer when he's fighting on the subway we don't know who he's fighting right but the subway number is 239 and in the comic book spider-man issue number 239 is the first time he fights the hobgoblin and get this in the comics ned becomes the hobgoblin and we know that the actor jacob Batalon got into shape and lost a lot of weight for the movie spider-man no way home dude it's gotta be ned